Hello, hello, hello again. Ah! I, I'm about to leave. Well, I was about to leave the house, but... <laughs> I got a birthday, an early birthday present. I am so excited. Um, so I'm just going to unbox this real quick. Uh, let's see here. And then I got to get up out of here. Before I'm any later. Actually, no, I'm not late yet. Let me see what time it is. Wait a minute, why is this oven on? Oh my goodness. All right. Always got to double and triple check before you leave the house. So yeah, so like, let me undo the box. Ah, yes, I'm an Aquarius baby. Birthday is next month. And got it in. Okay. So, that's what I got. Yay. And yes, it's a present for me to me, but it's still a present for her. I didn't think it was going to come in this soon because I didn't pay for the extra, you know, the express shipping. So, oh, wait a minute. What's this? Oh, this isn't what I thought it was. What's this? Uh, all right. This. This isn't what I ordered. Why is this in a green box? Um. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot. Okay, this is the real roll, and I forgot that I marked gift box. Yeah, on the real roll, you have the option of just regular shipping or they'll gift box it for me, and I forgot that I did that. It's an upcharge, but that's okay. Oh, I guess you want to see details, so hopefully this is showing well enough. Let me double check. This is the first time I've ever marked gift box on the Real Real website. Okay, yeah, that's coming through. So, this is a oh, black bow here. That looks like it's a sage colored box on the inside. So, oh, oh. So that box was just, I mean, this bow was just sort of sitting on there. Take this off. I don't know considering I bought it for myself I really like this birthday packaging well it's not birthday packaging it's just birth it's a gift wrap real real gift wrap so if you mark gift box this is what they'll do wow I almost don't want to unwrap it look how pretty this is oh somebody beat the heck up out of the box but that's okay Ooh, somebody needs to beat me for these ashy hams oh my goodness but anyways okay let me go ahead and open this Oh. oh, I guess it's telling me don't undo the wagon. Okay, so I'm just going to slide it off. There we go. And it looks like it has a little magnetic box. So, let's see. been lucking out like bandit finding what I well it should fit but Chanel pieces that should fit my plus size behind oh my gosh and y'all this is from oh my god it's gonna fit I can already see the waist this is from the 2019 collection y'all oh my goodness I'm so excited oh my goodness I'm so excited what is this Oh my goodness, I am so, so, so excited. Now, wait a minute now. Yes, it should fit. Anyways, this is a, this is a skirt. And I don't know what's going on with the real real saying that this is with tags and there's no Chanel tags here. The only tag that's on it is the real real tag. This is their own doggone tag. You know, of course that is not the price I paid, but huh. So anyways, this is from a 2019 knee length skirt. There's no tags on this. This is so weird. But anyways, has pockets. 
Oh, and this is so, it's so cute. I don't even know if y'all can see it like this, but it's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love, I love the pleating. Oh, and this is a little, just a little Chanel detail, you know? I don't know, let me, if that's gonna show up. Honestly, I don't know. Oh my gosh, I love it. Let me look at it a little closer. Oh yes, it's the, I don't think this is tweed. Maybe it is. All I know is I love it. I absolutely love it. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. Well, actually, it's probably a good thing that I didn't find out until now that um, this is a size 50. And I will say this, I'm actually going to do, actually, I'll do a video of one of these days on Chanel right away or sizing, because one size 50 is not the same as another size 50. And from what I've learned so far, 50 is the largest size they go up to. And they call it an 18, but I know doggone well I'm nobody's 18. So oh, I think some pieces are just cut more generously than others, hence why I'm able to fit into it. And one of the things I love about the real reel is that it actually shows you for, I would think 80% of the clothing items, um, uh, measurements. So like the chest, waist, and um, hip measurements. So this one came in at 40 inches on the waist, I think 45 on the hips or 47. So I was gonna be cutting it close because I measure my waist and it's 43 inches around. Yeah, y'all, I got yeah. <laughs> but you know what? This is, oh, this is such a cute little skirt. I love it. And for a fraction of the price, because what does it say the retail was? $2,900, $2,900 y'all. And I mean, that's just so far out of my price range I can't even talk about it. I don't know the bag that, oh my gosh, look at the lining. Okay, this was supposed to just be real quick, but I'm so excited. Ah, I got an early birthday present, I can't wait. Oh, I love it. I did order a um, coordinating top. So that's my birthday present for me to me. I've already given my husband a couple of options on the things that I want. Um, and it's going to be either a, uh, I told him I, I want to be surprised. So he, I said I either want a romantic picnic with him, um, a romantic picnic uh, by the beach. And uh, we live in Northern California. We live near, um, oh, I forgot the name of the place. Anyways, there's a nice little, uh, you know, uh, beach nearby. So romantic picnic at the beach, or I want to do something at one of the local wineries to do wine tasting, and um, or a picnic at the park. So either way, they're all low cost, because wine tasting, you pay like 10 bucks. I don't even know if they're doing wine tasting right now because of all the restrictions, but he can just go out and buy a few bottles of wine, set it up at home, and we can do our own wine tasting at home. You know what I mean? I gotta make it simple for my baby. So he should be getting me those things. And this is gonna be the outfit I wear for my birthday. So this skirt and then the top that I got to go with it. <laughs> so yes, I'm very excited. Okay, y'all, I'm supposed to bit out of this house. So anyways, oh, maybe if I leave this up, this will be a thumbnail. <laughs> All right, y'all, I hope you're having a great evening. And, um, oh, was there anything else I wanted to show you? Oh, well, I guess I should also show you now the normal stuff. The real real comes with this and inside of it, uh, you get your receipt. Oh, let me flip this over so you can't see my stuff. Yes, you get your receipt on the inside of it. And then to confirm, it says Chanel 2019 knee length skirt with tags. And that's the one thing I'm gonna have to actually write to, to the real world about because that's very deceptive. Um, to me, it's very, not very, but it is deceptive. If you say something is with tags, I'm thinking the retail, like the original retailers had, so the Chanel tags. Uh, this is now the second or third item that I've gotten where the real real has said, oh, this item is in very good condition, if not excellent, and it comes with tags. 
not tags that you made up on your own, <laughs> but maybe there's something, you know, I don't understand about that. I'll have to go on their website and research them. But my understanding, or at least my experience with the real, real before, is that anytime I ordered something and it said with tags, when it came, it had the original retailer's tags on it, which I love. But, um, you know, for my own reasons, I just think, oh, well, if the tags are still on, it's probably to get worn a lot. That's a good indicator of wear and tear. Anyways, but if the real world is just putting on their own tags and just typing in what they know the retail price was, I mean, that's fine, but that doesn't really, to me, it's a bit deceptive. Let me just put it that way. So anyhow, I'm happy enough with that skirt. Now, let me go try this on after I haven't had a big meal because I know it ain't going to fit now. I just had a chili dog. <laughs> But anyways, I'm rambling to get up out of this house. I will do a more formal video um, this upcoming weekend. I'm going to try to get more regular and like put up videos every weekend. Let's see how that goes. <laughs> All right, y'all. Until next time. Bye.